Hello everybody, welcome or welcome back to my channel, Let's Study with Debosh Mehta. Today I am back with another set of MCQs on VVM 2022 based on the topic Life of C.V. Raman and it is the part 2 video. If you have not watched my part 1 video, please watch it. I will give the link in the description box. Also, I have made a lot of videos regarding VVM that is Life of C.V. Raman along with Indian Contribution to Science which is also a part of our study material of VVM. So please go and watch those videos and all these questions are solely made by me when I was reading the study material. So let's begin. Now here is the first question for you. When is Science Day celebrated? Option A, 26th February, Option B, 28th March, Option C, 27th February and Option D, 28th Feb. Option D is the correct option, 28th February. Question number 2, a very easy question. Where was C.V. Raman born? Option A, Tirupati, Option B, Tiruvannathapuram, Option C, Tiruvannai Kaval and Option D, Trichanupoli. Correct option is Option C, Tiruvannai Kaval. Question number 3. Where did he start his career as a teacher? Option A. Presidency College. Option B. Society for Promotion of the Gospel College. Option C. Avian College. And Option D. A IACS. The correct option is Option B. Society for Promotion of the Gospel College. Question number 4. In which subjects did Raman receive first position and gold medals? Now here are the options that is English, Maths, Physics and Chemistry. Now the option is 1 and 2, B is 1 and 3, option C is 2 and 3 and option D is 2 and 4. So you have to uh, choose the correct option which is option B, 1 and 3 that is English and Physics. Question number 5. Why was Raman unable to go to England just after his B? Option A. He was physically unfit for European climate. Option B. He was mentally unstable to study at England. Option C. He was financially weak to afford it. And option D. He did not get proper scholarship to study. So the correct option is Option A. He was physically unfit for European climate. Now here there is an important tip for you or important fact regarding this question. That is in those days the degrees awarded to science students were called BA and MA, not BSc or MSc. Now, question number 6. Which metal sheet did Raman use during his diffraction band experiment? Option A, aluminium. Option B, iron. Option C, zinc. And option D, gold. Yes, the correct option is option C, that is zinc. Now, moving on to question number 7. What was the actual name of Nobel Laureate Lord Relic? Option A. John William Strutt. Option B. Williamson. Option C. John Eliot. And Option D. John Bilderbeck. And the correct option is Option A. John William Strutt. Now here is a picture based question. Here you can find an image of a letter. And uh, you have to uh, answer the question that is who sent this letter? This was a letter that was sent by somebody to someone. So you have to name that person who has sent this letter. Options are option A, Raman. Option B, Lord Relic. Option C, Professor Bilderbeck. And option D is Kelvin. Yes, the correct option is option B, Lord Relic. He sent this letter to Raman. The ninth question is, J.J. Thompson is known for Option A, discovery of proton. Option B, discovery of electron. Option C, discovery of neutron. And option D, none of the above. The correct option is option B, discovery of electron. The tenth question and the final question for today. In which year Raman was conferred with the fellowship of the Royal Society? Option A, 1987, Option B, 1934, Option C, 1924, and Option D, 1928. The correct option is Option C, 1924. So this much for today. Thank you all. If you like my video, do like it, share with your friends, and subscribe my channel. And also watch my other videos related to VV. And stay tuned. I will be back very soon with many more videos on VV. Thank you and bye-bye.